Imagine being at the absolute top of your game, the best in the world at what you do. Now, imagine suddenly walking away from it all at your peak. Welcome to Minute Facts. That's exactly what Michael Jordan, the greatest basketball player of all time, did in 1993. But why would the NBA's biggest star turn his back on the game? The answer may surprise you. This is the story of why Michael Jordan, in the prime of his career, shocked the world by leaving basketball behind. By the early 90s, Michael Jordan was untouchable. He wasn't just a basketball player, he was a global icon. Six NBA scoring titles, three consecutive championships with the Chicago Bulls, and universally recognized as the best player on the planet. MJ had it all, the fame, the fortune, the accolades. He was the face of the NBA, and the entire world was watching his every move. But behind the scenes, things were different. The pressures of being Michael Jordan were starting to take their toll. In July 1993, tragedy struck. Michael's father, James Jordan, was tragically murdered in a roadside robbery. Michael and his father had an incredibly close relationship. James was more than a dad. He was Michael's best friend and biggest supporter. The loss hit him hard, shattering his world. Michael Jordan I'm pretty sure my father's death had a lot to do with my decision to step away from basketball. The weight of grief, combined with the relentless pressure of being in the spotlight, pushed Jordan toward an unimaginable decision. But there was more to it. Behind that iconic smile, Michael was burnt out. Years of high expectations, the constant media attention, and the demands of being the greatest had drained him. Jordan didn't just want a break from basketball, he wanted a new challenge. Growing up, MJ had a second love baseball. It was his father's dream to see him on a baseball field, and with his dad's passing, Michael decided to honor that dream. In October 1993, Michael Jordan stood in front of the world and said, I'm retiring from the game of basketball. The world was in shock. Why would the greatest player ever leave the game he dominated? In 1994, Michael Jordan traded in his basketball shoes for a pair of cleats and joined the Chicago White Sox minor league system. Was he any good? Well, let's just say his baseball career didn't exactly go as planned. But this wasn't about proving himself on the baseball field. It was about fulfilling a promise to his father and finding peace away from the basketball court. Meanwhile, back in the NBA, the Chicago Bulls were missing their star player. The team faltered and the league wasn't the same without MJ. After a year and a half away, something started to pull Jordan back. He'd scratched the baseball itch, but deep down, he knew where he truly belonged. In 1995, the unthinkable happened. I'm back. With just two words, Michael Jordan announced his return to the NBA. And what happened next three more NBA championships. The legend of Michael Jordan only grew stronger. So, why did Michael Jordan leave basketball at the peak of his career? It was a combination of grief, burnout, and the desire to honor his father's memory. But stepping away may have made him even greater. His return to the court proved that MJ wasn't just the best basketball player of his era, he was the best of all time. Michael Jordan's brief exit from basketball is a reminder that even the greatest among us need time to reflect, recharge, and reconnect with what matters most. Sometimes, stepping away is the key to coming back stronger than ever. Because in the end, it wasn't just about the game, it was about the legacy. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more incredible stories about history, mysteries, and extraordinary people. See you in the next one.